We're back in our beautiful Cornerstone kitchen with our special guest, Gina, and two of her 21 grandchildren. You can see the rest of them here in this picture, but we have Sophia and Zachary to help us make another Thanksgiving favorite. Now, again, you have a big family to feed for Thanksgiving, and I hear this is a hit. This is your stuffing. Yes. And relatively easy to make. Yes. Is that correct? Very easy. Okay. I so just what do you have? The, the, the um, stovetop, not stovetop, oh, the stuffing. Uh, that's in the bag. Oh, okay. And so these are your bread breadcrumbs, right? Seasoning. And that this is one bag. Okay. And then uh, we take the uh, celery, mushrooms, onions, chopped up olives. So this is really cool. I love olives, but I've never eaten it in stuffing. Where did you come up with this? Is this a family recipe? Yes. Gotcha. And you just chop them up really small, mm. and you saute it, and then you and a stick of butter. A stick of butter. That's important, right? Stick that very important. And then you just throw it in here. Then you take a can of uh, chicken broth. Okay. And you pour, pour that in. in. And this is a quarter of a cup of milk and a quarter of a cup of water. Okay, mixed together. Pour and that right on top. you're gonna right throw that in. Now, we have two turkeys. <laughs> Again, I just made a turkey breast for you today. You have six kids, 21 grandkids with yeah. you and your husband. That is quite a feast. And we're gonna add some feast. turkey juice from here. Right into the pan. All right. And I'm cheating because I don't have homemade <laughs> turkey gravy today. Put some but, turkey gravy in there as well. But we're going to put some off. turkey gravy. And like I said, we make two turkeys, and then my son-in-law makes two fried turkeys. Ooh. Yeah. I hear that's a little dangerous. But the payoff is that fried he's, turkey's delicious. He's southern. He can do it. <laughs> he's brave is he's what she's brave. saying. <laughs> he's a southern boy, so he does it well. That's cool. And so then, you mix all of those together. Make sure it's all stirred make, around. Make sure it's all moist. So what I like about this and another recipe that you shared earlier with us is that they're relatively easy and Very that's easy. key during Thanksgiving when yeah, you're having you to make so many my things. My mother used to chop up bread, all kinds oh. of bread, you know, wheat bread, white bread, Italian yeah. bread. All right, we are going to employ your strong <laughs> grandson, Zachary, here to, yes. help, to help put this in the oven for us. How long does this actually go in the oven? Not long, about 15, 20 minutes. Oh, cool. And then when you take it out, if it's a little dry, just add some more of the juice from the okay. from the turkey. Keep mixing it in. And then just mix it in. All right, Zachary, will you do the honors okay, for Zach. us? We'll smooth that all in. Put it in, in the <laughs> oven. We need his muscles. This and is then a big pan. take it out and serve it with the turkey. Yeah, we want to see the finished product okay. here. I think we have that already have cooked up in the oven. Again, 20 the minutes. Oven. And then we we're going to serve oh. it with a slice of turkey. Delicious. With the stuffing and then you can taste it. Love it. Well, happy Thanksgiving. Thank you so much for visiting us here. Again, you can find the recipe to this delicious stuffing on our website. Log on to fox4morningblend.com. Happy holidays.